This old guy DIY video has to do with the technique I use to convert a Massey Ferguson Model 74 two-bottom plow to a single bottom plow so my 30 horse Kubota has a chance of pulling it. So what I did is remove the two bolts that went here and removed the nuts off the three bolts that were over there. Then I was able to remove the second bottom. You can see the three holes are here and the two bolts I referenced are there. And then I measured the space here that was made available and that was one and a quarter by two and a half by eight inches long. So then I cut a piece of hardwood and my source for hardwood is skids and I just need little chunks. You know, they're cheap and easy to get skids. I cut a chunk off and then cut it down to size. But I put this in there, all it's gonna face is compressive strength. These are 5 8 bolts. So I put it in position, pulled it in a little bit with a C-clamp. Now I'll get the nuts and washers and bolt this thing up. But that just takes up the space on that side. And looking at the second bottom, you know, it has this whole assembly. And I'm not sure if I'll try to move this over or not. But in the meantime, I will have a single bottom plow here shortly that I can use behind my Kubota L2550. So I hope this idea helps you. And all it is is a block of hardwood taking the place of the steel, bolt the thing together, and have at it. Have a nice day. This is what it looks like with that block bolted into place. I don't have any 5 8 inch lock washers, so I'm going to have to get those before I finish the job. But I believe this will do it. Have a good day.